Hi, my name is Daryl Peterson and I'm the manager of the Applications Engineering Department and I'd like to take just a minute to show you a new product that we've been working on. You may recognize this as it looks kind of similar to our traditional bridge completion modules, but now these are using a new technology. It's a new technology that's more current and yet provides a very stable response similar to what the traditional bridge completion modules would offer. If you look at the part number, you may notice something unique about this one. <clears throat> this one is called the MRF-50C-130. And what this bridge completion module offers is three 5,000 ohm resistors that are inside of this unit. If you look closely, you'll see a wiring sketch. You've got P plus, P minus, that's for your power leads to come in. You've got S plus and S minus, as well as the D connection, very similar to the traditional bridge completion module. So the unique thing about this one now is that it supports a 5,000 ohm strain gauge. So you can install a 5,000 ohm single grid strain gauge, wire it into this bridge completion module, and now you've got a complete circuit that you could connect to your data acquisition system. One of the reasons you might consider using the higher resistance gauges is that the lead wires will have much less of an influence due to the high resistance and additionally, you'll find that you could excite the Wheatstone Bridge with a much higher voltage now that the gauge and these completion resistors are 5,000 ohms as opposed to the more traditional 120 or 350. If you'd like to find out more information about the bridge completion modules, take a look at our website at www.micro-measurements.com. Look for installation accessories and then you'll see a selection for these new bridge completion modules, including this one for a 5,000 ohm quarter bridge strain gauge. Thank you.